Hello, hello, test, test. Can you hear me? Yeah, you can hear me, okay. So I, 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 I did a couple cool things, so it took me a little bit. Hey, I'm nine. I did a couple of cool things, so it took me a little bit longer to get this started. I have some new slides that I can use. Uh, so I've got to be right back, starting soon. Thanks for watching. And finally, the game. <clears throat> <coughs> I do apologize. Um, I am still sick. So I'm going to be coughing, and I don't really have a good way of uh, muting mid-cough while in VR. Um, <clears throat> so apologies for that. So, let's see, I'm still doing a little bit of setup. What you can't see is that I'm setting up um, <clears throat> screens to show things like my chat so that I can see chat midway through, and I just messed everything up somehow, and I have actually no idea how I just did that. So, one second. Um, um, I'm just gonna remove these windows. Um, uh, and change back to here. Okay, got my OBS window. And got my stream information window. And on OBS, I also want to go uh, <clears throat> to... see the twitch activity feed I want that up <clears throat> so I can see things like thank you delightful d d delightful uh, for the follow Let's move that over there, and let's see, spawn in one more window, and this is an important one, this is the chat, there we go, <clears throat> and actually I don't think I need the stream information window here. the activity feed. There we go. So now I can see everything that's going on here. Um, and I don't need to interact with those windows. I just need to see them. I might need to interact with this one. Okay, got that set up properly. <clears throat> Now, uh, now I can properly start the stream. So we're in Axia here, and uh, we're we're on a build that's not out yet, build two twenty. <clears throat> um, and today, what I want to do is try and create a stage in thirty minutes. So the kind of stage that I want to create, I thought it would be neat to see if I can create a stage stage. As in a, uh, so what I've got for the, what, what I had for the title, I think it's uh, creating a debate room. <clears throat> <coughs> so that is for the uh, up the rebuttal um, uh, role play that we played last week. I want to see if I can create a little bit of variety by having a new stage for it. And I want to see if I can do it in 30 minutes. I probably won't be able to do it in 30 minutes, but I'll try. So... <clears throat> We're going to be starting from scratch with an empty stage. And let's see. So let's create. Oh, created the clone. And empty stage. So, the first thing that I was thinking is well, first, I want to get rid of that comfort vignette. Um, <clears throat> and okay, so next thing that I was thinking is I'm going to go and design a layout. So. 
for a stage, I'm gonna want, ooh, gosh, an area where I can place. Uh, so here's, here's kind of my stage area. I don't think it needs to be too big. Um, <clears throat> next up, an audience area. And I think that's gonna be something more like this size. So I'm just gonna create the layout here. Uh, is what I'm doing. <clears throat> so there's my audience area. And then I think I'm also going to have uh, some spaces in the wings. So I want to take advantage of the the wall that got added in, but I, I, I don't know where it is in here. So let's, let's find out. <clears throat> uh, doo -doo -doo. Oh. Does anybody know where in the props list the wall is? <laughs> it's got to be in here somewhere, right? Fantasy. <clears throat> Under structure. Mmm. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Uh, stone arch, wooden floor, castle floor. There was a wall wall, though, wasn't there? I think it will. I think this will work, maybe. Let's see. Let's not set to snap. Let's change that. Poor snap. Okay. <clears throat> uh, yeah, maybe the one with the window is the one I was thinking about, but that wouldn't be very helpful, I guess, would it? Um. Is it gonna, have we changed this yet so that it'll, no, it won't let me do that. So I have to turn off, snap, once I've got it into the place that I want it. So, <clears throat> and then, oh, we, we also had, oh, maybe that's what I was thinking about. Um, the prop, oh, spending too much time thinking about props already. Um, We had doors. Where are those at? Where are the doors hiding? Urban. Oh, cool. We've got this. Oh, I'm discovering new things that I haven't... Oh, we've got a door here. We've got this door. Um... Sci-fi... Structure... Buildings... Oh, this is setting me behind already because I'm looking for these, this stuff. Okay, I'll go back to what I was doing. Um, <clears throat> so I've got a couple more ideas for how I'll handle this. And so the stage is going to be here, but the stage can have wings. Um, so really, this is just going to look like a, this kind of a space. And, okay. <clears throat> so audience goes here, stage goes here, just additional wing area there. So I'm going to need a lot of chairs. Um, I'm going to need to start thinking about the texture. Oh, I think red brick works fine for th the kind of venue that I'm looking at here. I can do red brick walls. Or maybe even red brick behind the stage. Um, and some wood for the rest of the walls. Yeah, so this is this is a debate room, I guess, but it's going to be... <coughs> <coughs> oh, 
Um, <clears throat> I'm kind of internally modeling it off of more like a, a, a comedy club. <laughs> Because the size, right? The debate room is going to be in this big amphitheater, or something like that. But uh, we're we're doing a we're doing a small scale debate room, um, and I don't think I don't think it would have windows. Uh, so let's just do this for now. And for the floor. Let's go to urban. What kind of floor do we want in this space? That's too bright. Um, I need a darker floor. Uh, why am I struggling here? Hello? Uh... There we go. Let's try this. Nice dark wood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. <clears throat> and this needs to be adjusted. Which means I need to pick that up. Uh, okay, so stage is gonna be here. Uh, going to props. Let's see how fast I can do this. Um, <clears throat> uh, sorry, delightful foe. Um, <clears throat> we're not gonna have any promotion going on here one second let me okay I'm not able to adjust that from I thought in the OBS menu I'd be able to just moderate that. I wonder if there's a... Um, yeah, I don't see any ability for me to do that here. Um, apparently that account has been suspended or deactivated already. A quick ban got rid of the message. There we go. <clears throat> and then let's see. Okay, what's up next? Hmm. We'll ignore that. <clears throat> <laughs> Let's see. What am I looking for? I want something that's going to be the base of the stage. Structure. Wooden floor works for me. not okay so let's try and get this into a nice position here actually I should turn this around so that the pivot point is like that that'll give me a little bit more flexibility and placement
and move that forward to the side a bit. And is this roughly lined up? Looks lined up to me. And now we're going to disable snap on each of these. And so what I'm thinking is, because you can't technically float, I'm going to just raise this a little bit so it's like almost not noticeable that you're stepping on... Uh, that, that your feet are clipping through. That looks lined up. Okay. So I've got my stage. <coughs> um, let's see. And so one of the one of the other main things that I generally am definitely gonna want uh, is I go to here, go to um, actually a ladder is gonna. I want a ladder. I want a ladder next to the stage. That's a good idea. Because then that can go up to some trussing. And then I can go... Um, <clears throat> oh, there's just going to be a lot of nice stuff here, isn't there? Like... Um, let's put some, like, random wooden stairs nearby. Nah. No. <clears throat> oh, yeah, 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 okay. This is... I, I'm going back to high school theater in my head and thinking that this is the stairs that's leading up to... Oh, I need to fix that. Leading up to whoever's got, like, a, a, a lighting room up here. Um, <clears throat> and then, let's see. More props. How are... What do these look like? Oh, that looks nice. Yeah, why don't I just go... 200% scale. And put this on either side. Try and get that accurate enough. Oh, and we'll put the ladder right here. Oh, that gives a, a nice texture to the wall here. I like that. Huh. Okay, uh, speaking of textures, I need to fix this wall over here. And let's see. We need a ceiling. What's the ceiling gonna be? Uh, urban, let's see. I want like some kind of plaster looking thing and I feel like the clay is the best that I've got for that. that the right choice not sure oh I kind of like the the vibe that that gives because presidential debate in like a rundown kind of space here also I do set the debate in the future when I run it because the future is just funnier uh, <laughs> <clears throat> <coughs> uh, 
Uh, let's see. Oh, I like I like the effect that that gave. And then let's see props, and I want to go into sci-fi, and I want dressing. So I'm gonna be placing a couple of these. Uh, let's see, back to props. Let's just check urban structures as well quickly. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna pick up trussing from sci-fi and do this. I think I'm gonna have a few of these put around. <clears throat> Okay, so this should be positioned in front of the stage, like so. I'm just going to line this up as quickly and roughly as I can. <clears throat> and I think maybe the one line will probably be fine. So it's 30 minute builds in Ixia are hard. Uh, let's see. I don't even know if I'm still within 30 minutes. I don't have a timer up. I don't know when I started either. Um, <clears throat> so that's maybe I should have done that. Turn off a floor snap on all of these and go up. And that looks good. Go up and go up. There we go. This is not lined up at all. Let's adjust it just a bit. That looks good enough. Okay. Um, connect that there. And add this in. <clears throat> at either end. There we go. Um, and I kind of want to add another one in here like so just a smaller one so I'll need two more of these and one more of these and this goes here this goes here These connect like that. Okay, I guess this goes here. And turn off floor snap on these and raise them up. Get that up to the same level as here. Okay. And then I've got these two because they are going to go like that. <clears throat> I might be thinking about the stage. I started around 11. Well, I don't know. I don't know what time it is now either. That's the thing. <laughs>
<clears throat> okay. Um, I kind of want to raise this a little bit still. It doesn't feel enough like a stage when it's so low. Okay, okay, so, you know what, yeah, when I look at this now, I immediately realize I need to move these still. Okay, that's probably a lot better. And maybe add in an extra support pillar near the... No, I don't want to block the stage too much. Um, maybe if I... Connect it? Like so, it'll feel more supported. Thanks, M9. Um, let's see. Uh, I'm glad you think it looks cool. I think it looks like it needs a lot of chairs. Uh, are chairs under small items? Are chairs under... They should be under decor, right? So I've got benches. I've got a chair that looks like this. I'm going to kind of take out a couple chairs and see which one I want. Um, and I've got under sci-fi, decor, more chairs. We don't want an office chair. We don't want stools. Um, okay, it doesn't look like we're going to use a sci-fi chair. Fantasy, uh, decor. We've got wooden chair. We've got seat bench. Seat bench might actually be a good one. Um, <clears throat> ooh, ooh, tavern bench might be even better. Just have these kinds of benches set up here. Um, and then, oh, we've got another bench. Hmm, I like tavern bench better. Okay, what do you think? Should I do... Uh, these chairs, or these benches, or these benches. I'm down to those options. Bench, bench, chair. <clears throat> hmm. Yeah, I like the back. I, I like back support too, but I also like the benches. And uh, part of me is thinking of committing to the uh, comedy club vibe, and putting like tables and like a little bar, um, <clears throat> and then maybe add some some benches in as well. Uh, let's see. So let's. I'm gonna go with the. Uh, actually, I think, um, 
that decision might make a lot of other decisions happen is uh, looking at the other tables that I have. Like, okay. Okay, so this, this roughly matches with that, but that's not quite uh, modern enough, I think. I'm gonna think I'm gonna go back into the urban decor and see if I can get more of a modern table. Um, and then... I'm having trouble grabbing stuff from the menu sometimes. There we go. Something like that is going to be the kind of table that I set up. And then over here, cashier desk, cafe counter. Um, let's see, anything else that I might want here? Um, <clears throat> Okay, let's look under fantasy decor again. Uh, see if there's anything here. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh, this is perfect. This is like actually perfect. Okay. Okay, we're going to we're going to do these. How many do I have so far? 9. Okay. I should have probably placed them all facing the opposite direction, because now I have to turn them all around. Okay, so we've got our front row seats. And our second row. Gosh, you'd think I'd be better at lining things up because I'm in VR, um, but I mean, it's hard to line things up in real life, too. I guess humans are just bad at lining up straight rows of benches. I, I wonder why we wouldn't have <laughs> evolved to be perfect at s lining up straight rows of benches. Like... <laughs> Uh Okay. Okay, so we've got our benches. Um I actually kind of want to delete the back row of the benches and put in those those tables. I think if I'm going to design a bar, it's going to need to be a little bit more in-depth than what I have time for. Maybe I actually don't do that at all, and I put those benches that I just deleted back in and call it with that. Next thing I want to do after this is uh, lighting. <clears throat> and so I'm going to go FX, lighting. I've got spotlights. And these will look like nice stage lights. Um, <coughs> so you're going to want one, two, three. And then another, like, one, two, three. 
And I'm using these as much as props as I am uh, lighting. Um, and then... Let's see... We also want... Some space up here on... Uh, we, we want like a kind of podium deal, right? Um, let's see... I'm almost wondering if this might be useful. Mm, not quite. What about this? You know what? You know what? I think I like this. Okay. Let's add two more of these. <clears throat> And I think what the trick is going to be is to flip these upside down. So I'm going to turn off floor snap on them. And use the gizmo to flip it as best as I can. And then let's try that. It kind of works, it kind of doesn't. Let's try unflipping it. It's probably better this way. <clears throat> and so we've got our stage there. Um, and these lights all need to be lined up. The lights have an interesting thing going on with them. And I think by now, okay, so we started at 11.50. <clears throat> it's 11.28, I'm a little over the 30 minutes, but I think I have like a decent looking stage for 30 minutes. Um, I am planning to keep going a bit beyond the 30 minute limit and see if I can polish it, but like, I think it looks decent. Um, main thing that I just got to do is get these lights actually doing things. Um, so let's do low intensity, high range on these. Um... And then I could just test this a bit by throwing down an NPC and seeing how the lighting changes on them based on, okay, so out of the light, it's like that. Move over here, got decent lighting. Over here, quite bright lighting. Yeah, I think that works. I think that just has naturally done good lighting for the area. <coughs> okay. Um, and let's put in a, a moderator just to take a look at this. Um, let's adjust this and add some characters, actors, <clears throat> um, and we'll have them. Ooh, did I just place two of the same? Nope. Uh, so we might as well just go for all the actors, because why not? Uh, who's the last one that I placed? That one. Fantasy... 
Now people can choose whichever character that they want. And I'll get rid of this NPC for now. And I think I do want to add in like a, a front door. I'm actually not going to connect this portal to anything. I'm just adding it in because may as well have a door. Uh, actually, no, I will connect it to something. Um, <clears throat> but this is going to be one way. So, did that. That's fine, okay. And then portal, put another portal here, and connect. Oh wait, actually I don't want that connection. I want this connection. <clears throat> and this is just a space as a GM for me to pick which character I wanna play. And I'm just putting all these in here. Um, so that I have a selection from them when the game starts. And maybe I can like switch characters out, uh, have special guests as well. Did I do fantasy already? Um, no, I didn't do fantasy yet. Okay. <clears throat> so now the GM actually has a selection of NPCs they can pick, and they can pick and choose based on what the player has actually picked. <coughs> and I think this came out looking okay. Um, what do you guys think? Uh, nice little stage built in about 45 minutes. Can certainly be used for our presidential debate. Um, <clears throat> I think I can probably expand this and yeah I, I do want a lounge area with like soda and stuff as well um, <clears throat> but I think for for up the rebuttal this this uh, would work fairly well um, yep looks good thank you Shinkar X um, <clears throat> and yeah I think this has come out well Uh, is there any ideas that you have for how I could uh, do this, uh, how, how I could change this, how, how you would do it differently? Also, I'm going to move that there. Ooh, I wonder what I could do for curtains. Curtains, curtains, curtains. <clears throat> Add a backstage later. Yeah, that's one of the things that I wanted to do, but I was like, okay, I, I only have 30 minutes to set this up. What I wanted to do is start in like <clears throat> a space like right here, right? And add like a, a sticky note that says over, over here for um, like here to go to the green room and here to go to um, the main area. So it's like your entrance hallway and then people going to the green room are going to be like the presidential candidates or the moderator and they'll go this way and then come out through here and then people going th to the main area are going to go down a different hallway, come down here and pop out and be like, oh, <clears throat> um, and I think that would be just like a nice little immersive bonus. Also, <coughs> the... Um, I would kind of like to be able to add something that looks like uh, curtains here that I could pick up and draw um, by just being here as the GM and just like move them off to the side. Uh, but I'm not sure what I'd use for that. I haven't looked through uh, what exists. I wonder what happens if I just like take this banner, which, uh, and make it real big. Can I use that as a curtain? No, it's not big enough. Hmm. Let's see, 
curtain, curtain, curtain. I do like what the wood divider does for the, for like adding depth to the wall there. Um, curtain, 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 curtain. Anything. Nature. Decor. Scenery. It's a pirate flag. Uh, why do you do this to me? This is an issue. There we go. Let me grab. What? Let me grab that. So if I scroll down, will it let me grab the flag? Yeah. Okay, the flag's two-sided. Um, I was hoping the flag was one-sided so I could put it... Uh, put it out there. I'm not going to find a curtain here. Okay, what about urban? And I'm pretty sure there's, there's no actual curtain prop. I'm just looking to see if there's anything that looks like a curtain that I could use. So this is actually possibly going to work um, and you'll, you'll see what I mean in a second if I do that and oh I did not mean to pick that up snap back please snap back to reality Oops, there goes gravity. Okay, um, and then I do this. Wow, I am so clever. I am so clever. What's the what's the scale on this right now? Let's bring it down to three fifty. And move that down. Yeah. Throne. <coughs> Place another one of these. Let's get that one also to three fifty. Turn off floor snap. Rotate, rotate. Move. Okay, I think I can go a little bit smaller than 350. Let's go 300. So the idea here is like I, I, oh, I can totally do this. Okay, I can start the session, right? And I can grab both of these at once. And if I hold my hand steady enough, I can just lift it like this. 
so I can actually draw the curtain. And then in order to make that work, because this is actually going to snap back down afterwards, um, I probably have to draw the curtain like that and then place it over here. <coughs> That's awesome. Okay. So we can use... Aha! Fancy! <laughs> I feel fancy for that. Um, so put up the thanks for watching. Um, <clears throat> yeah, maybe. I, maybe it's better to do it for one, but like... Come on, it's cool. <laughs> You're right, though. You're right. Um... <clears throat> Anyways, uh, thanks for coming and seeing the stream. I've got um, more planned. I'm gonna I'm gonna try and edit this into 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 a video, and <clears throat> uh, we're probably gonna be doing fairly regular like um, building a map streams. I kept this one fairly short, but I'd like to do longer uh for them right now i'm i'm, I'm still sick i'm still I, I took cough syrup just before doing this so i wasn't able to be as animated as, as i'd like to but <clears throat> we're also going to be doing another stream tomorrow and that stream tomorrow is going to be the ixia build battle um <clears throat> and so you'll see that event in the in the discord server and we'll be doing some more um building of maps uh, during that event and I think Shinkrex is also going to be streaming and this was also a test of my new computer see how well it streamed uh, was the quality good for you guys I can only I can only hope so I can only assume so uh, it seems to have been running fairly well <coughs> ah nice 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 um <clears throat> Also, you may have seen I accidentally switched to the um, <clears throat> game deck a couple times. Um, <clears throat> so we, we've got like a prototype game deck in here uh, that is <clears throat> uh, basically we, we've we've uh, plugged in Notion to it so that you can uh, even on Quest you'll be able to. <clears throat> access notes and files and stuff like that so that will be pretty neat um, so just like how I was able to bring up the video uh, video screen for myself to like monitor uh, twitch and stuff like that um, <clears throat> this will be specifically for will add in the information about uh, like uh, the, the information for specific role plays that you can run and that'll be uh, set on a, on a notion website so <clears throat> we'll be able to um, run role plays a lot easier with that uh, it's still a, a prototype we'll, we'll see how it goes uh, but I'm really, really excited for that because I tend to use third-party software, but I know for people that are on Quest right now, they can't access third-party software. So this this is our solution for that. Um, <clears throat> and it seems to be working fairly well. Anyways, thanks for watching. Um, I am going to end this stream now. I'm not very good at goodbyes, so I'm just kind of rambling <laughs> have a good one bye bye